So what do you do, Brian? He pipes. Set these on fire. Yeah, that's when it's fun. What's that? Max. It's a bit dangerous, isn't it? Yeah. Hi, guys. So I'm back, and I got more mail. So if you remember the last video back over there, no, uh, yeah, that way, um, we got the airbrush, uh, but with no compressor. So I ordered it the special uh, deal from Amazon that comes with a compressor and an airbrush and it looked pretty cool. The reviews were high, so meh. And again, I'm just getting into airbrushing. I have no idea what I'm doing, so keep that in mind. Um, but this was a pretty good deal and it seemed like a good starter kit. So let's take a look at it. I just got the box and um, so I opened it, but I didn't open it, see? Um, so let's see, this is actually, it's on, on Amazon, but it's one of those TCP Global deals. Um, if you go to TCP Global, uh, you'll see they kind of sell a little bit of everything, but they sell a lot of airbrush stuff. And again, I don't know if it's good, bad. There's lots of other people on eBay or in, on YouTube. A lot of people, more people on YouTube that can tell you if it's good, bad, or whatever. But we'll see as we play with it what we can find from a completely amateur standpoint. Uh, let's get rid of all this stuff. Okay, so that would be a compressor. Uh, oh, it's heavier. It is the weight in the box. All in all, um, interesting uses there. So you know, they want you to use your compressor like so. Oh, paint your vase. No, paint your back. Um, inflate your tire. Yeah. Oh, so yeah, well, this is a compressor, right? You can use it any way you want. Oilless. It looks just like the one on TCP Global um, and on eBay and a thousand other places. Um, it's got the, uh, the, this is the valve, uh, the, uh, you can set the air pressure. I know that much. I've done some research. Um, so yeah, I mean, it doesn't look too bad. It's cheap, remember? I'm just getting into this, so I'm not going to spend a huge ton of money. But it's a TC20, which this kit, by the way, this kit was cheaper than this compressor on TCP Global Direct. So keep that in mind. If you're trying to get into this, um, this kit alone um, was as much as just the compressor on TCP Global. And this came with a compressor and an airbrush down there. See? Airbrush and tube for the same price as the compressor on TCB Global. So whatever deal they got going with Amazon is pretty good. Look, it's an air hose. Okay, so pretty, pretty generic air hose. Uh, <laughs> um, and then here, let's get rid of this. So let's get in there. So this would be the airbrush you get with it. The G22. I have no recollection if that was a good model or a bad model. Um, but this is what you get in that kit on Amazon. You get the basically the baseline compressor and this airbrush. Let's see if we can get inside. Um, I seem to misplace my X-Acto knife, so I will use this handy dandy screwdriver. Screwdrivers have tums, so many uses. So let's get in here. <laughs> All right, so it's a G22. Nice case. It's a hard case. Well, that's nice. It's kind of a, a more resilient than a hard plastic case. So pulling it out, ugh. it's not bad. It's a little bit different than the one that my wife gave me. It's a little, I don't know, it feels lighter. Yeah, the dual action's a little bit different. It's not bad. Ooh. Hmm. Again, I have no idea what I'm doing. So I don't know if that's a good thing or a bad thing. Looks like a good thing though. But uh, yeah, another gravity fed down in there. So, hmm. 
Um, let's put that over here. You get the same setup that I got in the other one. You got your, your screwdriver down here and your nozzle for your hose and then the eyedropper thing. Let's see what the instructions from these guys say. Master Airbrush. So that is the G22 model. It's from Master Airbrush. So now go look up what TCB Global sells the Master Airbrush G22 for. And you'll see what kind of savings you're getting from Amazon, right? So dual action, uh, 15 to 50 PSI, hairlined at an inch and a half wide. Again, pretty generic instructions. However, they do try to market you down here. Go to our airbrush store. Uh, again, the map that tears everything apart. Really cool breakout here. That's not bad. That's pretty cool. It's very uh, blueprinty. Um, that's a little bit different. And um, it, oh, that's kind of useful. So when I break stuff, which you know is going to happen, um, they give you all the part numbers for all the pieces of your airbrush that when you break it, you can go and order more here. Um, I have no idea what I'm doing. So I'm starting cheap, um, thinking that um, cheap is good um, because I don't know uh, what I'm doing and I want to try stuff before I go and buy an expensive one. And I know a lot of the airbrush guys probably say, no, don't do that, buy, buy a medium one. Um, yeah, I don't know. Uh, I don't know if I'm gonna use it very often or what, you know? It's not a bad deal based on my research on the interwebs. This compressor, TCP Global, is as much as this kit that you get on Amazon. So I don't know why you would buy the compressor from TC Glo TCP Global Direct. Uh, you should, if you're gonna get that, go to Amazon and at least you get an air hose and a maybe good airbrush and maybe not, I don't know. So we'll find out because um, I'm going to test this out somehow. Again, no idea what I'm doing. So we'll see. We're going to test it with water, I think, is the way to go. But that's another video. Go away. Thank <laughs> you.